Unfortunately, not everyone can take the blood thinners that we generally prescribe for atrial fibrillation to reduce their stroke risk. Those patients are faced with a very difficult dilemma. If they can't take the blood thinners because of contraindications to taking blood thinners or from previous bleeding episodes on blood thinners or perhaps from frequent falls or other issues, then they're left not optimally treated in terms of their stroke prevention. So this procedure is really a very nice procedure for those types of patients in general because it does not require long-term continuation of blood thinners. And with this minimally invasive procedure, we can now go in your, into your heart without opening up your chest and just through minimally invasive techniques, remove the underlying part of the heart that causes the clots. The Lariat procedure is a multidisciplinary uh, procedure. We have anesthesia, the anesthesiologist and the nurse anesthetist providing a sedation to the patient. We have the ultrasound technician providing continuous observation with the TEE. Uh, you have the cath lab, the EP lab technicians uh, preparing the table, draping the patient, scrubbing. Then uh, you have uh, Dr. Bachelor and myself who scrub together on these procedures. Uh, we help each other getting the necessary access to perform the procedure. Uh, and then we have the uh, ancillary staff and the reps from the company who are there in every case. It's a company policy uh, to, uh, to show us the CT scan we obtained earlier in order to guide the uh, placement of the Slaria device. You really need two doctors who work well together, who understand and can predict what the other wants before the other person asks for it. Uh, so the main benefit is safety. The other thing, it, it's, it will shorten the time of the procedure because you have two people doing the work instead of one person doing it by themselves.